Hello there everyone, how are we all doing today? Welcome back to my channel. So today I am making over the Blue Velvet Nightclub from Willow Creek in The Sims 4. Um, this one, it really confused me to be honest, like, because I feel like the kind of vibe they meant to go for was like kind of industrial, modern kind of vibes, but it just didn't really come through with the build. So I thought I'm going to change all that. I'm going to make it more simplistic, more modern, and definitely more industrial, especially with all the new stuff we've got from the new pack. You know, I just thought I needed a complete makeover because I don't know about you guys, but Willow Creek is quite a go-to, like if I'm doing a Let's Play or something. I always go to Willow Creek or Oasis Springs because it's got all the nightclubs in it and stuff. But this one just made me so sad. Like every time we go there and then nothing would really be going on. So I thought I'm going to change that. I'm going to make it look so much better. And I think I succeeded. I'm not really sure because I don't know. But this is available on my gallery. My ID is KelseyKeenan727 if you would like to download it. It is down in the description as well, as well as all my social medias. If you'd like me to follow me on any of them, then they're all down there. Um, I did use stuff from packs. I apologise if you don't have packs, but I did use quite a few packs in this. Um, I couldn't name them all off the top of my head because, yeah. But I know that I definitely use like Eco Lifestyle, um, City Living, Get Famous, stuff like that. Um, as well as the new pack, obviously, as well as Werewolves. Um, but yeah, it was really, really interesting to do because I do a lot of base game makeups. And if you haven't seen them, they are all on my channel. Um, but yeah, like... I do a lot of them, but I've never done a commercial venue before. Like, I normally do like starter homes or like bigger homes, like I did the Goff's house and stuff like that. But I've never really done like a commercial makeover, which is crazy because there's so many commercial buildings that need help, like desperately. So I don't know, I, I've just never done it before. But it was definitely an eye opener because I don't, I don't think I've ever built a commercial venue thinking of it. I don't think I ever have, apart from a Vets, I've built a Vets, but does that really count? Probably not because it's basically handed to you on a platter because of the whole cats and dogs thing. You basically just get everything there anyway. Um, but yeah, I don't know. I've never done a commercial venue. So this was very interesting for me. Um, it has been absolutely boiling here. I am obviously from the UK. I don't know if you can tell by my accent, but yeah, I'm from the UK and it has been absolutely boiling. Um, I don't know if it has been where you guys are, so let me know where you're from and if it has been hot for you as well because I know that I have some audience in like Australia and stuff and I don't really know the weather cycles over there, I do apologise for that. Um, same with America, um, I have a lot of American audience, um, but yeah, I just, I don't really know, so let me know because I'm very, very interested, to be honest. Um, so just leave a comment down below the same where you're from and if it's been hot or not because here it has been so warm, I feel like my skin is melting off my body like oh no it's just too warm it's got to the point where you basically just sat there and it's so stuffy and like it's just really humid and stuff and the air's just really thick and it's just no i've just not even brave going outside i'm just sat here in my pajamas because i'm just not going outside today it's just not happening is it really <laughs> um but yeah it just yeah no definitely not I just don't feel like going outside, which, to be honest, isn't much of a change from how it normally is, to be honest. Um, but yeah, um, I decided to set up like a little karaoke studio as well here because I thought that makes sense. Like, if you go to a club, I know this isn't all clubs and stuff, I know, I know. But when you go to a club, more, not like a lot of the time, they have like little karaoke stations and little dance floors and stuff. But this build didn't seem to have any of that and I know that it's because of packs and stuff like that like you have to have city living or you have to have like get together or I don't know my wedding stories to have stuff like that but yeah like I thought it definitely needs like a redo with stuff like that because you know it just makes sense to me <laughs> and I, just, I put more of like a beer garden out back as well because you normally have outdoor seating but this place didn't really seem to have that like they had a fountain and a few benches but I feel like that's not very nightclub like at all i feel like they'd normally have like a little smoking area or something like that you know like i don't know i just feel like it wasn't the right kind of atmosphere for a nightclub at all um i didn't play with lights again i did mean to i meant to put like different lights upstairs and stuff maybe like purple or something like that um but i did completely forgot um so feel free if you do download it to do that because i really won't mind i probably won't even find out so you know um and then let show me as well like what it looks like at the end because i'm really really curious 
I also put cubicles in upstairs because I feel like that makes more sense to a nightclub. Like, I feel like they always have cubicles, but I don't know. That's just me. But anyway, we are coming to the end of the video now, so thank you so, so much for watching. If you like my content, then please don't forget to like and subscribe. Um, like I said, all my social medias and stuff are in the description down below, and I'll see you on the next video. Bye!